Anthony. It's nice to see you. Oh, it's nice to see you too, Osimo. And I am so happy to be here with you. Thank you. I'm excited to be here at AirVenture 2013. In fact, I have been taking flying lessons to be ready for this year's event. Well, you know, Osimo, there will be plenty enough time for you to do some flying a little later. But for right now, would you like to show everyone what you can do? Of course. I'm a very capable humanoid robot. Well, you certainly are very capable. Although you're also becoming quite famous. I mean, you've traveled all over the world. You've met royalty, heads of state. You've walked the red carpet at a big Hollywood premiere. And you've even been inducted into the Robot Hall of Fame. You know, Osimo, I think you're becoming quite a celebrity. <laughs> Although, I do think that some Honda engineers might have had something to do with your capabilities. Now, some of you may be wondering why Honda's committed so much time and engineering talent to create Osimo. Well, whether developing cars, motorcycles, or jet aircraft, Honda has always been a mobility company. And in that spirit, Honda created Osimo to help people who lack full mobility. Now, Osimo was designed to operate in our world, where we need to reach for things, pick things up, navigate along floors and sidewalks, even climb sets of stairs. And in the future, Osimo could assist the elderly, help someone confined to a bed or wheelchair, and the possibilities are virtually limitless. But today, what Osimo does best is walking and navigating our world with ease. And in fact, due to continued innovations and advancements, Osimo can even run. A little more about that later. Now, Osimo can sidestep continuously on a curve and in a straight line. Now, this actually can be very useful in navigating through those tight spaces in a home environment. Now, Osimo can walk forward. And Osimo can walk backward as well. Constantly adjusting its center of gravity with every step it takes, just like humans. And Osimo's balancing capabilities are so advanced that Osimo can even balance on one foot. Constantly adjusting 34 separate servo motors while analyzing a continuous stream of data from sensors throughout its entire body. Now, Osimo, I understand you have become quite the athlete. Yes, I can play soccer. That's right, we have a soccer ball. Okay, Osimo, show us what you got. that on your travels all around the world that you've picked up on some pretty cool dance moves as well. Yes, that's right. Well, would you like to show everyone here what you can do? I will be glad to. Okay. Osimo, hit it. Intelligence technologies alone are not enough 
for a humanoid robot to function effectively for us. Now, a robot must have the ability to dynamically adapt itself to constantly changing physical surroundings, which is why Osimo has the ability to recognize stationary and moving objects, and then autonomously avoid them while walking. Now, of course, our world is filled with steps and stairs everywhere we go. And what makes Osimo truly amazing is its ability to climb a set of stairs with smoothness and precision. Something made possible by combining all of its onboard technologies. Now, this ability is the culmination of over two decades of research and development by Honda engineers, and it is truly an historic step forward in human technological progress. Now, to perform this feat, Osimo stops momentarily at the foot of the stairs and then adjusts its position by reading a mark on the floor with a camera that's located in its torso. Osimo, are you ready? I am ready. All right then, go for it. Now with each step, Osimo must adapt and constantly counterbalance using all its sensors and computing powers to remain upright, adjusting all along the way. Way to go, Osimo! even more balance and precision to make it back down. Now, once Osimo detects the right position by using its camera, that's when it descends the stairs, continuously adjusting itself as necessary all the way down. Great job, Osimo! mentioned earlier, Osimo can even run. And it looks like Osimo's warming up, <laughs> which is definitely something we all should do before any physical activity. Now, pay close attention to Osimo's feet. When Osimo runs, both of its feet will leave the ground at the same time, if only for a moment. But this does make Osimo the only life-size humanoid robot in the world that can run at a very high speed, nearly four miles an hour. Gym metric is six kilometers an hour. Now, Osimo, you let me know when you're all warmed up and ready to go. I am ready. All right, then. On your mark, get set, go! Woo! Nicely done, Osimo! Now, Osimo, we need to see that again. <laughs> Now this is an astonishing feat. Osimo's airborne, which means its feet leave the ground for about 0.08 seconds. That actually is very similar to that of running humans. Now Osimo, are you ready to run again? I am ready. All right then, go for it. Where do we go from here? Well, someday a humanoid robot like Osimo might serve as another set of eyes, ears, hands, or legs for people in need, performing the types of routine tasks that make our lives a lot easier. And in fact, recently Honda has developed a series of cutting-edge intelligence technologies that will improve Osimo. That these new improvements will enable Osimo to operate autonomously with people or even other Osimos in a coexisting quality. Now this brings Honda one step closer to the development of a humanoid robot that can be put to practical use in a real world situation where people and Osimos will coexist. So someday Osimo may do work that's dangerous for humans like fighting fires or working in unhealthy environments by cleaning up toxic spills. But one thing is for sure, today Osimo is the world's most advanced step in innovative mobility. Thank you very much. And thank you very much, everyone. We hope you enjoyed the demonstration this afternoon. If you'd like to learn more about Osimo, you can check out the website. It's osimo.honda.com. Be sure to like Osimo's Facebook page, too. You'll find some fun and exciting things there as well. And let's hear it one more time for Osimo, everyone.